Yo, what's up guys? Dual Black Scene Legends is back with another video. In this tutorial, we're going to talk a little about plugins. So what are plugins? Let's say I hop on to studio like a random game and like I'm trying to edit it. So as you see, there's a tab called plugins. So what are plugins? Plugins basically they help you build like more easily in, in a game. For example, there might be plugins that like help you. There are plugins that like help you change like the color or like the size of a part for example like there's many plugins and like they, they serve many different purposes that could make your game like look good like there's GUI plugins and there's like a lot more so today we're gonna talk about how to install a plugin in order to do this you gotta have toolbox open which is you have to go to home and then click toolbox to enable it after you enable a toolbox, you should see this in your window. Let's go to plugins now. So you click the arrow here and then plugins. And as you see, there's a lot of plugins. However, some of them cost money. Robux. Some of them cost Robux money, but some they don't. Like this one is free. So what is this one? Let's see. Load character. Oh, so you basically when you install this plugin, you should be able to load the character if you use it. So let's click install to add a plugin. And it is installed, it says. So now let's go to the plugin tabs and there is there is load character right here. Let's click it. Let's try typing my user, so it's iGamer the developer. And that is me and you could select R6 or R15 so there's a lot of options that you could do let's spawn more on one R6 let's put it down there and then one R15 and basically that is how you install plugins there's like a lot of things you could do like all these plugins they serve different purposes like for example this one they talk about loading characters like this one this one is like antivirus so your game won't get hacked or anything and this is the building tools that like you could change the size and stuff with like you could install all of them and then play around with it but yeah this is how you install plugins to your roblox studio hope you enjoyed the video if you do please like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video bye guys 